गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स इन आर प्रीवियस क्लास वी रेड अप टू द लाइन शी वेंट ही वेंट डायरेक्टली टू द वेटिंग मैन नाउ विल स्टार्ट विद द लाइन इज डैट यू बॉब ही आस्ट डायरेक्टली सो इन आर प्रीवियस क्लास वी रेड दैट देर वॉज अ पर्सन हुज नेम वॉज बॉब एंड ही वॉज वेटिंग फॉर हिज फ्रेंड एंड ही वॉज स्टैंडिंग नियर अ हार्डवेयर स्टोर एंड द पुलिस मैन हु वॉज अ बी ड्यूटी observed him he watched him and after that he asked means he went to the person and the person came himself to the policeman and uh, start telling his story that i am waiting for my friend to whom i promised to come after 20 years at the same place so here uh, i am waiting for my friend it was said by bob to the policeman who was on the beat duty when uh, bob told everything to the policeman the policeman went from that place and after 20 min minutes one uh, means another person who was a tall man came directly to, uh, to the waiting man he went directly to the waiting man who was the waiting man bob was waiting man who came from west so the person came uh, means he went directly to the bob and he asked to bob is that you bob he asked doubtfully means the tall man asked doubtfully to the bob that is that you bob he confirmed is that you jimmy wells cried the man at the doorway at the doorway means he was standing near the doorway of the hardware store so the person who was standing near the hardware store he he just cried he was happy so he cried is that you jimmy wells both confirmed to each other and after that bless my heart exclaimed the new arrival who was the new arrival the tall man the tall man was new arrival and he just showed his happiness and said bless my heart and grasping the other hand uh with his own means he just grabs his uh, uh, both hands with uh, one another and after that uh, uh, he said i was certain i would find you here if you will uh, if you were still alive and he said that i was sure certain means sure i was sure that uh, if you are alive definitely i will find you here definitely i'll meet you well 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 20 years is a long time and after that he said ki well 20 years is a really a very long time the old restaurants gone bob and uh, the new arrival informed bob that the old restaurant is now torn out i wish it had lasted so we could have had another dinner there and he just showed his wish that if the same restaurant lasted here means situated here uh, uh, still situated here so we could have have uh, could have had another di uh, dinner there so he said ki if uh, the restaurant endure here then uh, we could have one more dinner there how has the west treated you old man and after that the new arrival asked to bob that how has the west treated you treated you means behaved with you because he went west to make his fortune that's why he asked that how the west treated you how the west behaved with you old man it has given me everything i asked it for <coughs> and bob replied that west gave me everything whatever was my desire you have changed a lot jimmy I never thought you were so tall by two or three inches. And uh, here Bob is surprised to see Jimmy and he said that uh, you have changed a lot. Means your, uh, you are two or three inches tall. Uh, then uh, means when he left the place at that time uh, Jimmy was 20 years old and after 20 years he increased his height two or three inches means his height was increased two or three inches oh i grew a bit after i was 20 and jimmy replied 
कि ओ आफ्टर ट्वेंटी ईयर्स माय हाइट वाज इंक्रीज्ड डूइंग वेल इन न्यूयॉर्क जिमी एंड बॉब दिस टाइम बॉब इज आस्किंग टू जिमी दैट आर यू डूइंग वेल इन न्यूयॉर्क मींस यू स्टेड हेयर एंड डिडेंट लीव दिस प्लेस सो व्हाट आर यू डूइंग हेयर राइट नाउ मॉडर्नेटली आई हैव अ पोजिशन इन वन ऑफ द सिटी डिपार्टमेंट्स कम ऑन बॉब we will go around to a place i know of and here and have a good long talk about old times moderately means uh, means very fairly very quietly he said that i have a position in one of the city departments that i am uh, he said that i i am on a very good position in one of the city department he didn't confirm here that in which department he is but he only told that i am uh, i have a position in one of the city department in which department he didn't tell here and after that jimmy said to bob come on bob we will go around to a place i know of and have a good long talk about old times and after that he offered to bob and said ki okay come with me and we'll go uh, at a place which is uh, familiar for me Uh, and uh, after that we will talk with the, uh, each other for our uh, old times the two men started walking arm in arm aur haathon mein haath dal kar like good friends they started walking the man from the west the man from the west means bob basking in the glory of his success was beginning to outline the history of his career the other listened with interest and the man from west means bob he started telling his uh, means his successful story uh, of uh, of his glory and uh, the second one means the tall man was listening everything very carefully very attentively At the corner stood a brightly lit medicine store when they came into its glare the friends turned to look at each other the man from the west stopped suddenly and freed his arm and when they were just walking arm in arm and they were busy in talking bob was just telling his uh, successful story to the tall man at the same means uh, then because uh, mm, means uh, they were walking so they reached at a point where there was a long and harsh light they reached near a medical store and there was strong and bright means light and when they came into the glare glare i told you that is strong and harsh light so when they came into the strong light friends turned to look at each other then they both saw each other's face the man from the west the man from the west means bob stopped suddenly he suddenly stopped and freed his arm he just set free his arm from the tall man's arm because he had doubt when he saw the tall man's face he stopped and he freed his arm you are not jimmy wells he snapped means uh, he was surprised to see and he declared he said that you are not jimmy wells how he recognized he said 20 years is a long time but not long enough to change a man's nose from a roman to a pug and bob said he uh, means uh, i agree with this statement that 20 years is a long time but it is not as long that a roman's uh, nose change to a pug nose roman means uh, a person whose nose is roman's nose uh, nose is uh, means commonly it is a high bridge nose and pug's nose uh, pug means uh, they have short nose with uh, an unturned tip okay so a long nose cannot change into a flat nose and he mean to say here 
कि 20 साल का समय बड़ा होता है लंबा होता है इसका मतलब ये नहीं कि किसी एक पर्सन की लंबी नाक जो है वो फ्लैट हो जाए आ, इतना लंबा समय नहीं होता है बीस साल का इट वॉज सेड बाई बॉब ओके इट समाइम्स चेंजेस अ गुड मैन इन टू अ बैड वन सेट द टॉल मैन एंड टॉल मैन सेट येस अ रोमन्स नोज कैन नॉट चेंज टू अ पग बट अ गुड मैन चेंज इन टू अ बैड मैन इन ट्वेंटी ईयर्स इज अ लॉन्ग टाइम वेन मीन्स ड्यूरिंग दिस टाइम वी कैन से दैट अ गुड मैन कैन चेंज इन टू अ बैड मीन्स दिस वॉज अ कमेंट You have been under arrest for टेन minutes, and he said that within टेन minutes you will be under arrest. Silky Bob, the Chicago police, thinking you may have come this way, wired us that you are wanted. And uh, he said that when you left Chicago, the Chicago police knew very well that you may come. means they had doubt knew very well can't say they had doubt ki definitely you will come to this place so that's why they wired us means they, they did a telegram to us and informed us that you are wanted by chicago police means chicago police informed to new york police that this person is wanted by chicago police going quietly are you and the tall man said that you were going quietly that's sensible and sensible means uh, realistic practical and he said ki it is practical now before we go to the station here here is a note i was asked to you i was asked to give you you may read it here at the window it's from patrol man wells and uh, the tall man informed bob he said ki before we go to the police station i have a note for you and it was said to me to give this note to you and you can read you may read this note here at the window because uh, near the window there was light that's why he suggested ki near the window you can read this letter and this letter is given by patrol man wells means the person who was on b duty that person gave this letter to tall man to give this uh, means letter to bob patrol man wells means jo b duty pe patrol police man tha usne us tall man se kaha ki tum ye letter jo hai uh, bob ko jo wahan pe hardware store ke paas khada hai use dena okay The man from the west unfolded the little piece of paper. Unfolded means opened. Okay, so the man from the west means Bob. He opened the letter. His hand was uh, steady when he began to read. So when he started reading, his uh, hand his uh, hand was uh, fixed. balanced at that time when when he started he was balanced he began to read but it trembled a little by the time he finished but when he finished his letter his hands were shaking what was the reason the note was rather short itna chhota sa note tha kya likha tha us note mein let's read bob I was at appointed place on time when you shifted and uh, and the dim light fell on you I saw it was the face of a man wanted in Chicago somehow I could not do it myself so I went around and got a plain clothes man to do the job so what was it in the letter it was written in the letter uh, uh, said means wells Jimmy Wells said, "Ki Bob, I was at the appointed place on time. I was at the appointed place on time means ki if I promise to come on the particular on the same place, so I was there. Means I didn't cheat you. I was there on the appointed place. But when you shifted uh, and the dim light fell on you, means I was talking with you. I was just." Uh, 
means uh, taking de details from you at the uh, same time you shifted to the dim light and when the dim light fell on you i recognized your face you were the person who was wanted by the chicago police and uh, it was my duty to arrest you so but because you are my best friend so it was not possible for me to do it myself that's why he went back and he just uh, searched a policeman who was without uniform to do this job so he searched a policeman who was without uniform and he sent the he means jimmy well sent the policeman to the bob so this is the story uh, students in this story it is said that uh, uh, jimmy and bob were good friends and uh, jimmy uh, sorry bob wanted to do something more he wanted to earn name and fame and uh, money so he decided to leave new york and he went to west he asked to his friend also but at that time jimmy was not ready to leave because he loved new york very much and they left uh, the place means uh, bob left the place and they promised with each other they promised to each other that after 20 years we will meet at the same place on the same time and when bob reached to meet after 20 years when bob reached to meet his friend he found that there was a policeman who was a who was on beat duty but that policeman was jimmy wells and he was he too was waiting for his friend but when he saw his friend's face and when he recognized that the face was the same face who was uh, wanted by chicago police so it was his duty to arrest the person because he was criminal but because he was his good friend so he means he could not do it himself that's why he sent another policeman who was without uniform okay so this is the story now the chapter is finished and uh, the question answers i will gi give you okay